What is going on YouTube? You're watching Next Gen Speed. And today we're going over a new product release that we have at nextgenspeed.com that our friends at Extreme Online Store just sent us. This is for all you C8 mid-engine guys. This is a new product release that I was excited for for a really long time. Been wanting this in my car for a long time and I finally got them in, so here they are. So here we have the new carbon fiber side door handle scoops. So if you look on the side of the C8, I'll put a picture up right here so you can see it better. These are pretty much the side scoops that go on the side of the vehicle, so. As you see right here, these will kind of tie in just like that. And then that will go in just like that. So these are pretty much just the side of the vehicle where the door handles are and the little side scoops. And these do come in four pieces because the car does actually have four pieces as well. Because you have the door handle piece that pretty much goes right here, under here as well. And then just the main piece right here. So, so these ones we have right here are made of official 100% real carbon fiber with a gloss finish on it, as you can see. Got that great quality carbon fiber weaves in there. Everything matching perfectly. Nothing looking jagged or nothing like that. So these came out really nice, which I'm happy about, so. These are one of the first of many carbon fiber parts that Extreme Online Store is coming out with for the new C8 and a lot more coming, so. Really excited with all the new parts that they're coming out with. They have great quality products, and honestly, you cannot beat the prices on them as well. And compared to the other ones you see in the market, you will see that they're actual direct replacements, but these ones are actually overlay covers. So you pretty much just peel off the tape on these, install them on your original part. You'll not have to remove anything, take apart your door, take apart the fenders, nothing like that. These are pretty much easy install, only takes about five minutes. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do that and do a little overview for you guys. You know, I'm not trying to hate on anybody or any other company. I love everybody around here doing the, doing the thing, you know, selling these parts and coming out with some good stuff, but do not pay over $600 for these items. We got these available for about $350. And just to add, like, all the ones we see on the market are going for like $600, $700, but these are literally about $350 shipped. So, honestly, you cannot beat this. I'm so glad our friends at Extreme Alliance were finally came out with these. About to make the C8 look great, guys. And I've been waiting so long because my car has a carbon flash metallic on it right now, and I'm trying to convert everything to the carbon fiber. So, this is gonna match perfectly with the car. Got the carbon fiber highway to match that. Got the carbon fiber front lip as well. Got some other stuff on the way too. So carbon fiber should bang's gonna be all over the whole thing, man. It's gonna look great. So we got these all prepped up, ready to go. Got that double-sided tape on the back adhesive, all good to go. And if you guys didn't notice already, the seat is not here in this dirty shop because it's in the middle of winter. So we're gonna head back home where the seat is stored. Gonna go throw these on, show you guys how to do it and do a little overview for you guys. So let us head into it. Be a fun drive home, guys. I just cannot wait till it's 80 degrees and sunny out, where it doesn't get dark when I get off of work. We're just nice and warm. I can just enjoy and drive my C8. And just to give you guys a little comparison. It's the carbon flash metallic, as you can see. Metallic flakes in there. Here we got the carbon fiber style. So that looks awesome, guys, especially with the red. That pops out nicely, has a nice little accent to it. And just for the overall test fit, actually, everything's matching up nicely. Matches that body line perfect. Perfect down there. I think we're good to go on this one. This looks awesome, guys. Pretty much OEM-like fitment, you're not even going to notice that this is just the cover, guys. Especially for the price, because GM actually charges $2,500 USD for this actual piece right here. It, it's actually the whole piece right here. That's actually like an OEM replacement, but with these covers, you save thousands, and it's much easier to install. You know, they take part of the whole door panel, everything like that. So, it's a much better option. I'm so glad Extreme Alliance came out with these. So, let's get these boys on. Just going to clean this area. Alcohol swab. Pretty nice and simple, easy to prep. The car only has a few thousand miles on it, so it's pretty damn easy to clean. So now I got the first piece right here. Just gonna peel off the tape off the back of these. All right, the tape is all removed. Pretty much all good to go. I do recommend to add some heat just to help with the adhesion, but these are pretty much all set to install. So let's just line it up. Let's see. So 
So I'm basically going to press on this corner real quick just to make sure it lines up that edge. To kind of follow it just like that. It's a bit hard with one or one person, but just gotta line up the points on the ends. Make sure she's flush and then apply some pressure. Looking good there. Looking good there as well. So I'm just gonna hold in place for about uh, 30 seconds at least. Just make sure it does not move. And it's on guys, check that out. Little comparison between the two. But everything's looking nice, everything's fitting flushly. Nice and tight. Make sure the door opens nicely. Nothing's hidden. And we're good to go on that guys. That is awesome, I'm loving that. Let's get this other piece on real quick. This one's good to go. Just gonna line this edge to make sure it's nice and perfect and even. Got that edge on there. Looking nice right there so far. Looking nice right there. Let me just apply pressure across the whole surface. Then just hold it in place for at least about 20, 30 seconds. Officially on guys, looking nice. Can't even tell it's a cover. <laughs> Check out that carbon fiber in there. Cannot go wrong with that carbon fiber. So now we just gotta get the left side on and we're good to go. Damn, she's looking good, guys. <laughs> Cannot wait till summer. So I just gotta line up this side. Make sure that's flush. good so far just got a pot pressure and she'll be all right so we got this side officially on guys installation is complete and i'm loving that carbon fiber on these side wings i'm waiting for these for a while these are officially now available at nextgenspeed.com my friends at next room online store officially in stock ready to go no wait time on these but she's not paying 2500 but she to wait a couple weeks for them so officially available for about 350 bucks do not wait on these got you all ready to go but as you can see, it does not affect the door handle function at all. It's good to go. And that's pretty much it for this video. But I'm actually going to catch you guys in the morning. I'm going to pull the car out, give you guys a little better view of it. And take some nice shots because this looks amazing, guys. Can't get over it. Finally got everything to match the high wing, the front splitter. Now all I got to do is pretty much get some carbon fiber mirror caps. Also got these grill inserts on the way as well for the front. And I'm pretty much trying to cover up everything on the car that is carbon flash metallic, as you see right here. Trying to make all that carbon fiber. So... Stay tuned for more videos, but I'll catch you guys in the morning, give you guys a cold start, and show you guys how, to, how this looks in some good light. Good morning, guys. Switch to the next day. Let's pull the seat out of the garage, get a nice little cold start for you, and see how they look like in the sunlight. There she is. The carbon pipe wings on there. Finally seem a bit better since the sun is officially out. I'm gonna pull out the Corvette in the driveway in the snow. Give you a few pictures of it. Sounds good. Also, just added the rock guards recently. Make sure my line store the XL rock guards. Looking very nice. Got on the front and on the rear. 
carbon fiber front splitter on it. And also the carbon fiber high wing as you've seen. But I seriously cannot wait to drive this damn car. It's been too long. It's too damn cold over here. I really think I need to head over to Miami, Florida because this snow is getting really annoying. Not be able to drive my car like this for a few months out of the year is getting really annoying as well. So I think it's time to move to Miami, guys. <laughs> we'll see. Should I pull it out real quick? Take a few pictures out there. much better now like that deep grumble but definitely thinking about adding an exhaust soon not sure if i go the r or fed speed exhaust way let me know the comments below which exhaust you guys should you guys should think i should go with because it's a hard decision right now with all the options we've got available but i'm really looking leaning towards the all option or the fab speed actually the first time the c8 has been in this snow guys <laughs> Oh, definitely in the sunlight that looks amazing guys high gloss carbon fiber can't go wrong with that guys i'm loving the car so far got a lot more mods planned soon so please stay tuned for more videos but if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe for more and i will see you guys next time